guys, I'm Raya. Welcome back to my channel and if you are new, thank you for tuning in. Today I'm going to be showing you what I got from Zara. Now, I'll warn you, this is going to be quite a long video, okay? Let's just see how many things I got here. I got not one, not two, but three bags full of Zara stuff. I'm really excited to be showing you these pieces that I picked up and i was actually in zara for a very short period of time because i just saw things whiz around say yep like that like that and just grabbed them so i hope you like them too and without further ado let's get into it so guys as titled i did get like just about nearly a 500 pounds worth of stuff so i think what i'm gonna do first if you don't mind is just show you everything i got then i'm gonna try it on so you know if you like you can just forward past it and just go to the trial these are a pair of joggers these are like a, a knit jogger the quality looks really nice but i do think that it's gonna like bubble because look i don't know if you can see but the, it's already like this and i haven't even worn it so i'm not sure how i feel about that i don't think the quality is all that but let's see how they look like on by the way the joggers were 25.99 and in a size small so the next item i got is this really nice little pullover jumper and this was 15.99 and in a size small i thought this would look really nice on top of a blouse i don't know if you guys saw my h&m haul but i did pick up an alpaca pullover jumper and it just made me look really frumpy but i'm still in search for like a sleeveless jumper that i can wear on top of a blouse i think it's really ideal if you work in an office where the temperature fluctuates or you're traveling and you get really hot on the tube or something it just helps to layer up and i think that is a key piece to have whilst on knitwear i picked up this really nice jumper it's very thick knit and it's a peplum kind of hem at the bottom here and kind of cuff sleeve and it's got some buttons at the back this was 29.99 and in a size small i think it looks really feminine so i hope that looks nice on again on the chunky knits i did pick up another chunky knit jumper which uh is in a size small and 25.99 this is the back bit I, that i'm showing you i've got a feeling it'll probably look better on than what i'm showing you right now or how i'm showing you it this is quite cropped and it's got kind of hem sleeve the next item i got here is a really nice chocolate colored bodysuit in a size small and this is a basic and it is 12.99 i love this color i think this looks beautiful on every skin tone it has a thong bottom which i like and the it's got, it's got like kind of a wide sleeve it's not really sleeve because it's sleeveless anyways it's just wide around here and i know this is quite flat uh, it's quite a flattering look on for most people the next item i got here or items because it's more of a set is this really nice cute cropped roll neck knit and it's it's looking a bit purplish but it's more on the brown mauvey kind of color but i think it was 9.99 i think i will link it down below for you anyways if it's on their website and i got this skirt to go with and this was 19.99 and in a size small so i think that's really nice cute workwear outfit especially for the winter and i think even going into spring you can wear you can still wear a polo neck on top of a blouse like a pep to give that kind of peplum kind of look so the next item i got is this really nice knit again in a size small 19.99 really nice knit wrap over top i don't know how i'm gonna wear this because this looks like quite long but i suppose once it's on we'll see what it looks like so i hope it's not too low low cut and you can adjust it because i'm not like as much as it looks nice i am not very comfortable showing too much cleavage when you go out i hate people staring there especially men i think it's a bit too much and i feel a bit uncomfortable for me personally if i'm with all my friends i'm actually fine 
but I generally don't like to wear anything too low. low now another thing I got for workwear are these trousers. Now this is actually made out of 50% recycled polyester. So I'm really pleased about that. I am quite concerned when it comes to shopping, when I'm shopping at Zara, H&M, Pretty Little Thing, places like that. I'm very conscious about our eco footprint, eco footprint, our carbon footprint and what fast fashion does to our environment and how terrible it really is but i'm really glad zara are taking steps to help the environment by using you know recyclables being quite conscious about it just like h&m a lot of their things are recycled and they're really making an effort to make things more sustainable going forward so little rant there um sorry i know it's not i'm not perfect so anyways um, these trousers are an extra small and these are $29.99. I really liked this belt. I thought this is going to look really nice. Zara trousers do fit me usually, but it's just sometimes the length. If it's a crop trouser, then they will work fine. Again, I am five foot nothing, so I don't know how well these will look on. So the next thing I got is this jumper. Now, I don't know why I got another black jumper. Like, I got this from Lounge. It's very cropped. Maybe that's why I've got another black one because it's very crop. But I'm actually looking for something beige-ish. Like beige-ish. Beige. That's not even a colour. A more beige uh, colour. But this was £10.99. No, £9.99. Beg your pardon. In a size small. And again, this is made out of 50% ecologically grown cotton. So I'm quite pleased that Zara, again, are, are making an effort. That's... um. That's a real like relief for their consumers that are buying these products that were, you know, not just buying fast fashion stuff and it destroying our environment. So I'm gonna try this on and see how it looks. It does feel quite comfy and inside it feels really soft. So I'm really happy about that. The next thing I got is this. Now I thought I was just gonna wear this with like a pair of really high-waisted trousers. I love the colour. This is so me. It's a fine knit. But the model online had this over a shirt. So I don't know if I can carry that look off, but I will try it on and show you. So this is a size small and it's $12.99. So the next thing I got here is this really soft knit t-shirt can i call it a knit t-shirt it's more it's a top it's not really a t-shirt but again this is made out of 25 percent recycled polyester so a little less eco-friendly but it's nonetheless still you know eco-friendly and this is a size small and it's 9.99 i really like the collar it's very audrey hepburn and i absolutely love that look they did have matching joggers but I just knew that their joggers would not fit me. They look so long on. I thought, okay, that's just not going to work. Unless it's got a cuff bottom, it's just not going to work. Like, I know. I know when I go shopping if something's going to fit me or not. <laughs> the next item I got are these really nice waxed trousers. These are in a size extra small. I don't know. I was just feeling very optimistic when I bought these, I guess. Because it is an extra small. $29.99 absolutely love these like love 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 you can wear these for work i mean i certainly would i'm just gonna zip it up so it's all tailored i love this feature here this this made out of lyro lyrosil or whatever that is called i don't know but it's got a lot of detail here and on the back as well and it's quite a wide kind of pant or trouser and I th and, it, and it's supposed to be quite cropped so as long as it shows some of my ankle I'm going to be pleased with that I really do love the look of it I love wax anything wax and I think you can still wear it going into the spring even the summer you could probably wear that on a night out in the summer with something cropped and winter time you can obviously wear that the lovely pair of boots underneath whilst we're on the leather kind of bandwagon here or vegan leather this is a pair of leggings in extra small 19.99 i really like how it's got even though it's leggings i really like how it's got a loop for your belt so it can look like a trouser so these pockets are actually um artificial well i don't know what that is there but they are actually real pockets but it does give you an illusion of like 
wearing a trouser so and they do have a little zipper at the bottom so i'll see how this fits finally last but not least I've got a pair of flared trousers. These are 95% ecologically grown cotton and this is 19.99 in a size UK 8 or 36 or if you're in the US 4. Sorry I didn't go into all the other sizes before but you guys know the deal right? These are a nice denim wash and kick flare. I've been long searching for a pair of jeans, kick flare bottom that will fit that aren't too overdone especially if i'm petite but it's called a cropped flare so i think these will fit i'm, I'm really hoping that they they do so what i'm going to do now is try them all on in the order that i showed you so we're going to go from the beginning and then work my way to the last item which will, is the pair of jeans so this is what the trousers look like on they are a little bit long at the bottom think if you are literally like above five foot these will probably fit you just like perfectly and this is what it looks like on so the zipper is actually showing which i'm not too fond about but i think if you ironed that bit flat then it should be fine so the next thing i've got on is this jumper that i showed as a pullover this fits so much more better than that alpaca one that i showed you from h m and i've put the i've left this open you can of course do this up if you want to look ultra smart but i prefer to leave my collar a little bit open and show a little bit of neck that way i don't look too busty and this comes out and it does give you like a peplum effect and I'm not sure if I'm looking okay on the sides, but hopefully I don't look too big. And the back, oh, I can't really show you the back. But anyways, that is what it looks like on. I really like this outfit together and I'd definitely wear it for work. The only thing I would say if you are gonna wear it for work is on this little stud here, but maybe no one really notice it. So the next thing I've got on here is this really nice knit top. So it's very chunky. I didn't actually think I would like this top when I put it on. But I do like it, but it's a, it's a high neck, but it's not, like, it doesn't strangle you or anything like that. It does have, like, buttons at the back, two buttons at the back, a mother of pearl kind of button. But I haven't actually done them up because I'm finding them a bit of a faff, especially if you've got, like, nails. The sleeves are very, very chic. I think they go really well with the black trousers, actually. And they look, like, it, it does feel quite comfortable, so quite pleased about that if i'm standing this way i don't know how flattering it is on me but i do actually like this so there's loki hey likes <laughs> and uh so i've just paired this top with the same jeans and a belt to give it a different look now i don't know what to think about this top i've just clipped my hair up because it's very roughly and i do feel like it's a bit too much ruffle so this is the back. I don't know if you can see just in the mirror, but that's the back of this top. So I think if you're taller, it'll probably sit a little bit better on you. But for me, I just feel a bit frumpy in this. So I will probably have to give this a pass. So the next thing I've got on is this bodysuit. Now this is what I meant by it's very like flattering because it's got quite a wide, I don't really know what to call it. So I'm getting proper 60s kind of vibes with this. So this is what the collar looks like. Now the collar, I don't think it's meant to roll like that, but it kind of is. Maybe if I just adjust it. It's, it's quite fitted around the neck. So if you don't like tight things like me, then you probably might not feel very comfortable in this. But I'm getting very 60s kind of vibes in this. And I think that you probably could wear it for work because it looks like a one piece kind of dress, but I would probably wear it with a different pair of shoes. I've just paired these with a pair of the kind of sock toe boots, like from Ego, Ego shoes like this. It has pockets, which is really handy. And this is what the back looks like. And it's quite cozy and comfortable. Um, I feel, I don't feel too like uncomfortable in it. I do like it, but this is just a bit kind of 
tight around here but the arms and everything are I mean, for me, they're personally quite long, but if I just pull them down up to here, then they don't ruche up and they look fine. So the next thing I've got on are these joggers. I've just paired it with my crop lounge sweatshirt, and these are the joggers. I don't know if you can see. They're quite, like, you can probably get away with them being a little bit smart. Like, I've just paired them with a pair of loafers, but you, I mean, I could wear these with trainers and stuff, and this part here is cuffed so i'll just show you in the mirror actually how i would wear it so it's like this it's quite long and it's like that but you could actually tuck it in and make it like a thin cuff so i'll just show you in the light here so you could make it like that and show it a bit more ankle so this part is the slimmest part and then it can look good on your body and Again, as I mentioned, these are very comfortable, very snug, but I'm not sure about the quality. And for me, if I'm going to wear lounge stuff, the quality needs to be good. Like, I would probably go for the joggers to this make a set because the quality to this, I've worn it tons of times and it still looks brand new. This is the oversized sweatshirt. I probably won't keep this only because I've already got a black one and I probably would want to get another colour in this but it is very comfortable and this is 50% recycled cotton it's very soft I don't know if you can see that never mind probably can't but it does actually drown me I don't think this outfit does much for me unless yeah no it really just doesn't do anything for me at all but it is very comfortable I'd probably wear this with a pair of leggings because it still is slightly shorter but I probably wouldn't wear these together because I just look like drowned in this. So these are the trousers on. Now this is an extra small, but I would probably get an eight in this only because it fits very snug here and up the crotch bit. And it's a little bit like up my bum sort of thing at the back. So this is the Audrey Hepburn-ish top that I got it's a bit baggy around here and I would have preferred it if it was very cropped but it is overall very soft for £10 and the trousers if you are around my height again for reference I'm five foot nothing I would probably get these in a <laughs> excuse my messy background by the way I'd probably get these in the size eight but you would probably want to wear heels with it or something with a little pair of heels because they sit just perfectly like with heels but I couldn't wear it with flats I'll just show you an example so I'm just going to show you what these look like on for reference with a flat so it sits just underneath but they do bend like just here they just bend and I don't really like that with flats and with the heels they sit completely straight but what I like with Zara uh, their trousers their length actually fit petite people so but this is actually ruching up so I yeah definitely would probably go up a size in this so this is the trousers and the top that I've got I absolutely love these trousers the only thing I will say is that sometimes when you're looking at it from a different angle it looks like there's something on them because they're waxed because it's just like a reflectant I will probably change these and go up a size but overall these are so flattering they literally go all the way up to your waist and they fit me so well around the ankle even if I am wearing flats and I would wear this even on a night out or a white blouse to go to work in and I think these are beautiful. I love this detailing. It looks really high fashion with these details here. It's a little bit tight around the crotch area, but again, if I size up, I think it will be fine. This is the top. Now, the only thing with this top is that you can't actually wear a bra with it, so I've just put one of those stick-on things, but I probably wouldn't feel comfortable going out like this because it is a bit much and in your face, but if you are comfortable going out in it, then I think it would look fabulous, again, on every skin tone, given the, the colour of it. It's really nice and chic. And this is the back bit. And that's the back bit. So these I'm getting very 70s vibes. Left the top on. I might try it on with something else. But I've just paired it with my Gucci, Gucci or Gucci belt, as I like to call it. 
some loofers and these actually fit really nice and they fit me perfectly as in the length wise I like these I might try them on with a pair of heels but I do like the way they look I don't know if I'm looking too wide around here because it does make me look a little bit dumpy so I'm not too too sure the butt is somewhat flattering but I'm not sure if I love it love it but the length is great it's just this part here isn't doing a great deal for my thighs so this is what the top looks like on with the jeans the jeans I am really loving but my thighs do look a bit dumpy so I've just paired them with a pair of flats to show you how the length comes up on me for reference and I think it does come up quite well so this is what the jeans look like with the heels on they fit I don't know if this is making me look dumpy because flares are actually meant to be quite flattering I mean this angle is okay but turn to the front this angle not so much forgot to mention these leather leggings in an extra small did not even go up like past my knees it literally went through my ankles and that's it so these I would definitely like they're not as stretchy as you would think they are for leggings but they definitely yeah I would say Zara sizing is very true to size so an extra small is an extra small and a small is a small so yeah that's just just to give you an idea but these leggings are a bit too tight for me and plus they sound a bit plasticky if you're going to walk around in them unless you're wearing them on a night out but yeah I just thought I would mention that so guys these are the boots I really I do like them they're very Doc Martin like but they are an aubergine colour I don't know if you can see and I don't think this will go with a lot of stuff that I have I know it's looking dark um it's not quite black though as you can see you've got purple there so if they were black I would have kept them but I am in search so let me know if there's any shops that I should be looking at or anything online that I should go to I have been looking at a few like lavish Lux and ego official and i'm not sure if i found anything that i really like but these are comfy good quality they are leather um but yeah the color is not so great so really sorry about the lighting it's completely dark outside but i hope that the new light bulb that i've got has now changed that so i really hope you like the pieces that i got i hope that you have a good idea of what they look like on and what the quality is like please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up and also don't forget to hit that notification button so you can know when i upload a new video which is usually weekly and yeah please do give me a thumbs up and let me know comments down below what you think and what you thought and if there's any suggestions yeah i will see you next time in my next video bye